today with this super fun and super cute DIY, you will need a ruler, some jewelry wire, scissors, fabric, a glue gun, and some extra glue sticks just in case you run out of other ones. I purchased both my wire and my fabric at Walmart, and let's get into this super cute DIY. To get started, I'm just going to measure about half of my fabric and make a mark so I know where to cut it. And then I'm just going to cut it down the middle where I made that mark. And lay aside the extra fabric to make a bun tie out of. It's very easy to follow these instructions, just different measurements. Then I'm going to just crease my fabric as much as I can so that I will be able to get a nice um, flat cut and be able to insert the wire later on. I will measure about to my head, about where I feel like it should go, and leave a little bit of um, uh, leave a little bit of extra fabric so that we, because we will be cutting off some more than we need. I'm just going to make sure that crease is more defined. And hopefully my ruler will help me help me be able to get that crease as defined as I can. And I'm just gonna cut off the extra fabric that does not line up with the other ones because when we cut it down the middle, probably didn't cut it very straight. Then I'm just going to create a little cut diagonally on the ends so you can create the cute little bunny ears, as I like to call them. Then you'll just bend the wire in a circle so it doesn't poke through the fabric. You can also add some just like clear scotch tape or some duct tape at the ends to make sure that it doesn't poke through even more. Then you will add some glue on the edges and then you will fold it down the fabric so that it looks like you sewed it even though you didn't. This is my favorite part because it makes me look a lot more professional than I actually am. So this helps a lot. Then you will just fold it close after all the edges are folded down and you will glue those all together. You want to leave one side open so you have a place to enter the jewelry wire into. That's what I'm doing here. It took me a while because I had added too much glue when I folded it down so it got stuck a little bit. So be super careful when you're gluing down the headband. After it's in, if you have any extra jewelry wire hanging out, you can cut it off and bend it down or just bend it down a few more times. And then you will just glue that end shut. And that's all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know that I've been wearing this so much and it is my most favorite thing to wear. I have a lot of cute shirts to go with it and you can just pair it with anything and it's so cute for spring. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe below.